Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Denisa and this is Vividly Denisa. Thank you for joining me for this video. I know, I think I've put out like two videos this week. Um, I think I'm just kind of trying to make up for lost time. So I'm trying to make as many videos as I can while I while I'm free. <laughs> I don't know when. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna try to make it a, a weekly thing, at least once a week. Um, so please stay tuned to my other videos as the as the weeks go by. But um, I wanted today I wanted to talk about something that I think a lot of people wanted to know or would like to know. Yeah, whether you're living in Japan or you're thinking about coming to Japan and you want to learn the Japanese language. So first, um, just kind of like a brief overview. Coming to Japan, I think I knew as much Japanese as the next person, um, very little. I didn't know how to read Japanese, like hiragana, katagana, kanji. I didn't know how to read any of that. Um, I tried looking, like before I came, I tried looking online for like Japanese classes, but unfortunately, like my city, we don't have a lot of Japanese speakers, or at least not a lot of classes, so I wasn't able to take classes. And my university, like they offer classes like Chinese and Korean, but unfortunately not Japanese. So I came to Japan, like only knowing like the popular phrases that, like a tourist or a foreigner would obviously know coming to Japan. And so I kind of, that was able to <laughs> um, help me for the two months I was here before I started. You know, I found a new program and I was using that. Um, I joined, um, my boss was able to take me to free Japanese classes, but unfortunately those weren't really helpful because they like they didn't really even teach me how like the alphabets because you have to start from the basics like if you can't if you don't know the alphabets for any language then you're it's gonna be really hard to go from there and so they kind of you know they were nice enough to, they taught me a lot of phrases like ways to introduce myself but as far as like words alphabet like hiragana katagana kanji they didn't really they didn't help me with that and so I felt like I kept practicing but I felt like I was stuck so I knew about this program called Kumon I kind of searched it up before I came but the pro like the the programs that they offered I couldn't use it in the US I had to be in Japan in order to be able to use it and sorry for the glare in my glasses. I have my windows open this time. And I always, I always have glare in my glasses because I can't see without them <laughs> or else I would have taken them off, but sorry. Anyway, um, I researched about Kumon before I came. And so I was able to see their prices and the kind of courses that they offered before I came to Japan. And speaking to one of my coworkers, he kind of re you know reassured me that Kumon is a very good program. He was telling me about a f like a previous teacher who had used Kumon, and by the time she went home, she was you know almost fluent in Japanese, and, and now she works for a Japanese country company in her country. And so I was like, okay, great. Kumon at least so they have two courses. So there's the correspondent course as well as the um, kind of in-person course. So the corresponding course is the one that I use. So they will send you worksheets, you work on it at home in your own time, in your own pace. And after you're done, you send the worksheets back to the teacher. And the teacher looks through it. If she, you have any mistakes, she'll like my teacher. So this is, so this is what I get sent, like in a, cute bag um so this is how they will send it to you in like an envelope like this and the teacher would have um she will he or she will email you oh send these worksheets by so and so day and so you work on them and you send it back to um he or she and 
then if you have any mistakes they'll send you back with like sticky notes like please correct these mistakes <laughs> and like these are just a bunch of ones that I've collected over the time but yeah send you like the the worksheets with sticky notes like please correct these mistakes you correct them and then you send it back to the teacher with the new worksheets that she wants he or she wants you to send for that week um, and then part of the correspondence course is that you get two Skype calls a month with your teacher and it's about 20 30 minutes and during the Skype calls you will kind of go through these are like I look I see them as textbooks so they're for each like section so I've, I've gone through like three sections now <laughs> so I have three this is the one that I'm on right now and so you you know you talk and you go through the different words and the different stuff so there no there's no English this is just you reading it and making sure that you know the alphabets and you, like you know the letters and you know what each word means and this is great like this has really helped me like when I'm working on the worksheets and I'm writing down the hiragana or katagana, I'm like, there's no way I'm going to remember what any of this is. And so by the time I'm talking with her, I'm like, okay, I know what this is. Okay, I got it. And so this is really has really, really been helpful. And you can also use this to practice on your own time when you're just like going through them. You know, maybe you're lying on your bed or whatever. So these are really helpful. Um, I carry them with me all the time, like in my backpack. If I'm bored, like if I have time, maybe a student of mine doesn't show up, then I just work on them. It's the the correspondence program for me. It's about ten thousand and two hundred yen, which is about give or take, round up $100 a month. It's a bit pricey, but I feel it's really, really worth it um, for all the knowledge that you're, you know, all the things that you're learning. Without this, I don't know where I would be because I feel like the fact that I also have to pay for it has helped me gain the motivation that I need to stay on this. I'm learning Japanese faster and easier than if I was like trying to Google the words like, okay, and like it would be I feel like this is so much easier for me because it's like a class it's like going to school and I'm used to going to school so this is normal for me and so it definitely definitely helps also oh I forgot also you with each section you get like CDs with each section I'm like three CDs. <laughs> and so with these CDs, you go through the worksheets and you can listen to the pronunciations, like the fluidity of the speaker, and you can practice on that. And like, yeah, all this has been really helpful to me. Um, it really, really makes things a whole lot easier. Like now I know how to write hiragana, katagana, I know how to read it. I haven't gone to kanji yet, and I, but I heard it's the most difficult, so I'm not really looking forward to that at all. I'm praying it's not so difficult for me. But yeah, so yeah, I get like the school sends me these, I think maybe, I think I received like two packages last month of worksheets. And yeah, so you can keep these worksheets. like. The teacher will send all the stuff back to you every time, you know, so you can keep all of them. She also, she's so sweet. She also gives, like, sends me, like, a folder where I can, like, after each section is done, I can put all the worksheets together in this, like, cute folder. And my teacher is very sweet, you know. Every time I speak to her, she's like, are you okay? You know, is there anything you need? I'm like, no, I'm fine. Thank you. But yeah, it's it's been a lot of love and it's it's been amazing. And so I just wanted to recommend this program. This is not no one's paying me to do this, but I felt as though this is something that, you know, I was very fortunate for. I was very fortunate to learn about as well as to have my coworker kind of reassure me on try at least giving it a try because 
it's something you can quit anytime. So I have to pay in the convenience store. And so if it's for some reason, I'm like, okay, I don't need this anymore. I can just quit. So I do, I do recommend giving it a try. Um, if you're someone who's serious about the language and who might be having a difficult time finding avenues to learn the language, because not everyone has, you know, like maybe Japanese friend or Japanese coworker who has the time and the energy to help you. And sometimes you have to do it by yourself. Like I have Japanese coworkers who are, you know, glad to help me, but they're also very busy. And I don't, I feel like I'm, you know, like a burden, like, you know, asking them to help me. Like sometimes I ask them now, but since it might be just something that I'm confused about in the worksheets, but since I have the worksheets, it's just like the little things that I would ask for their help. Like I'm not asking them to take hours out of their day to just tutor me. And so not everyone has those avenues. So I do feel this is a great self, self-help, self self-work program that you can use to learn the language. Because I really do want to learn. And I want to, you know, because I don't feel... 100% comfortable and I know I'm never going to get that because I'm I'm a foreigner in a foreign country but I do want to learn and I do want to understand what people are saying. So this has really really helped me. But yeah, that's it for this program. Uh, that's it for this video. What's wrong with me? So yeah, if you guys have any questions, please comment in the comment section and look out for my next video. This has been Vividly Denisa. I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.